We made this last record, Last of the Great Pretenders, here in uh, the Bay Area, San Francisco. Woo! Right down the street from my house. I live in Bernal Heights, and uh, we made it in Lily Valley. And every day, I'll make this short, but every day we went to this cafe, and we fell in love with the waitress at the cafe. So I wrote this song about what she and my imagination would do if they had a night together. I felt like it was such a magical experience for me, I needed to remember it. Of course, she did not. Uh, and so, I wrote this song, long story short, I might have talked about it in USA Today, I might have told everybody the name of the place that she worked, and what she looked like. And some of my fans maybe made a little pilgrimage there a couple times, a couple ten, couple twenty. And they seek this, uh, so now this, this lovely waitress knows that this song is about her, which makes it slightly uncomfortable for me to return uh, to said cafe for food. It puts a little bit of added weight on, yes, I'd like fries with that. You know what I mean? It takes on a different heft. So this is a song about a fictitious relationship that I enjoyed tremendously. It was magical. It was brief, not because of me. I'm a stallion, see? And I would have loved all night had I been able to. I'm so sorry. So this is a song for all the dreamers out there. This is called Girl in the Kink Shirt. Oh 